Welcome to the fascinating world of multiples and the least common multiple. In today's lesson, we'll explore the wonders of multiplication and how it applies to real life scenarios. Multiples are a fundamental concept in mathematics. They are what you get when you multiply a number by another whole number. Think of them as the building blocks of multiplication. To find the multiples of any given number, you can simply look at its times table. For example, the multiples of three are three, six, 9, 12, 15, and so on. Similarly, the multiples of 10 are 10, 20, 30, 40, 50, and beyond. But why are multiples important? Well, they come in handy when solving tricky real-life multiplication problems. By understanding the concept of multiples, you can tackle these problems with ease. Now, let's delve into the relationship between multiples and division facts. You can use division facts to check if one number is a multiple of another. How? It's simple. If a number divides exactly with no remainder, then it is indeed a multiple of the number you're dividing by. For example, let's take the number 15. If we divide it by 3, we get 5 with no remainder. This tells us that 15 is a multiple of 3. On the other hand, if we divide 15 by 4, we get 3 with a remainder of 3. This means that 15 is not a multiple of 4. Now here comes the exciting part. The multiples of a number will always divide exactly by that number. So if you encounter a division problem that leaves no remainder, rejoice. It means that the number you're dividing into is indeed a multiple of the number you're dividing by. So understanding multiples and their relationship with division facts is crucial in solving multiplication problems and identifying multiples in real life situations. The next time you encounter a tricky multiplication problem, remember to harness the power of multiples and their incredible ability to simplify your calculations. With that being said, complete the exercises on the next few slides. 